this is Tasleen Jamila, your holistic consultant and coach. Yes, TasleenJamila.com and MySoulSpeaksInstitute.com. I want to talk about the winter solstice. What is the winter, winter solstice? What should I be doing? Winter solstice is coming up tomorrow on the 21st here in the U.S. And different cycles. We deal with the different cycles of spring. You have summer, you have fall, and you have winter. It's a very powerful time. In African culture, it was also many things were done on the winter solstice to bring it in because it's a newness. It's a new time um, to harvest new things, not only physically, but within yourself. So it's a great time to sit and be quiet today, to do a very clean um, eating and diet. If you can fast or just eat raw foods or juices or whatever you want to bring it, just clean clean conversations sit and meditate and tap into the divine within you the God within you to see and to know what do I want to come clear to decide if I got mess in my life messy people no more to decide I'm gonna elevate myself to the next level for this new side season and new cycle we are people of the cosmos and we should be in connection with this cosmic cycle that is going on with the rotation of the earth with it coming to after the 25th going to be longer days these few days on the 21st through the 24th are going to be all the same time um as far as the time in the in the daytime and we want to take advantage of that powerful energy that is being sent on this planet and that's connected many people around the world that are going to be doing the same thing, meditating. So sit by yourself, write out your journal, chant, sing, and just go inside yourself. You know you are connected. You have a, a complete connection to tap into who you are to find out what am I going to do different that's amazing? What am I afraid to do? How can I push past that to get to the unknown? I once heard something, a quote that said, you should be afraid of the known instead of the unknown, but you shouldn't have any fear at all. And even if you do, push past it. Go into it. Think bigger. Think bolder. Build something grand. Stop thinking small. You are an infinite being here, and you're sent to do wonderful, great things. We have a kingdom to build here. This is heaven right here. This is heaven right here. This is heaven right here. You can create it in your atmosphere, in your relationships, within your health, within yourself, bringing joy with whatever your divine purpose is.